All right, it's exciting. You're about ready to build your website. And one of the first steps is getting a domain to put your website on. And you wanna know, is it possible to get a free domain? The answer is yes, but. So in this video, I'm gonna go over six places where you can actually get a domain for free. But if you stick around till the end, I'll explain to you why we always end up purchasing our domains and where we buy them from. We are an affiliate to some of the companies that I mentioned in this video. So if you click on any of the links down below in the description, we may earn a small commission, but at absolutely no extra cost to you. So the first option we're gonna talk about today is by a company called Freenum. So you can go to their website, type in the domain that you're looking for, and what's gonna happen is they're gonna give you five options for what are called top level domains. So .com, .co, .biz, et cetera but it's not gonna be .com, .net, or any of those. The ones that you can get free, and it's free not only for the first year, but also ongoing, you can get the following five options. .tk, .ml, .ga, .cf, and .gq. So if you want your domain to end in any of those five top level domains, you can actually get your domain for free. The main issue here is, I don't really know that many legitimate businesses that use a domain that ends like this. So normally we recommend using a globally recognized domain such as .com, maybe .co or .net, or if you're operating in a specific country that uses a different domain such as .es in Spain or .ca for Canada, those are great as well. So the next three options we're gonna talk about are through the website builders, where you can get a domain for free for the first year. So the first one of these options is Wix. So with Wix, you can get a domain for free for the first year. Renewals start at $14.95. One of the things with Wix is that the domain does not include privacy protection, the free or the renewal. So if you don't want to have your information publicly available, such as your name, email, and address, you'll have to pay an additional $9.90 per year uh, for the first year, as well as additional years to keep that information private. So the next option is Weebly. So Weebly is another website builder where you get a free domain for the first year. Uh, the nice thing here is both the free year and the renewal include privacy protection at no additional charge, but the renewals here do cost $19.95 as opposed to $14.95 with Wix. So the third website builder where you can get a free domain is with Squarespace. If you choose any of Squarespace's annual plans, you can get a free domain for the first year. Uh, renewals for the Squarespace domains do start out at $20, so basically the same price as Weebly, and similar to Weebly where all of their domains, both free and paid, do include privacy protection at no additional charge. So the next two options we're gonna talk about are with the hosting providers. So with the website builders I talked about previously, hosting is included with the cost of the website builders, but one of the most popular options for building your website is with WordPress. With WordPress, you need to pay for hosting separately, and a lot of the hosting providers will give you a free domain for the first year if you pay for hosting. The first option we're gonna talk about here is Bluehost. So Bluehost, you can see, is the number one recommended option on WordPress's website, and so it's a very popular option for building WordPress sites. Again, the thing with Bluehost is you can get the domain for free for the first year, um, but you're gonna pay 99 cents per month for privacy protection. So again, if that's something important to you, you're gonna spend another $12 per year for privacy protection, even though you got the domain for free for the first year. The cost of your .com domain annual renewal with Bluehost is only $12.99. So this option is slightly less expensive than the previous three options that we talked about. So if you don't need privacy protection, you're only gonna pay $12.99 versus $14.95 or $20 with the other three examples. So the last option we're gonna talk about today for a free domain for the first year is HostGator. HostGator, again, is another really popular hosting option. They have plans starting out as low as $275 per month for hosting, and they do include a free domain for the first year. Again, the issue is here with HostGator, if you do want privacy protection, it costs even more here. Privacy protection is $14.95 per year with HostGator. So what you might have noticed from the previous options is that most of them don't include privacy protection and the ones that do are slightly more expensive. And so if you're a bricks and mortar business where your address, phone number, email address, and all that are publicly available anyways, then privacy protection probably isn't a big deal for you. If you're a small business owner like myself, or if you're starting a side hustle, and maybe you don't wanna use your home address and phone number and email and things like that, and have those be publicly available, privacy protection is something that's 
that's very important. So that brings me to where we purchase all of our domains, which is Namecheap. So with Namecheap, currently you can purchase a .com domain for the first year for $8.88, and that domain will renew for $12.98 thereafter. The nice thing with Namecheap is all of their domains always include privacy protection at no additional charge. And so just the cost of the domain is cheaper than most of the other options that we talked about, plus you're not paying the $9.90 all the way to $15 that some of them are charging for privacy protection. Namecheap is running promotions all the time. For example, right now they have a bunch of domains available for just 99 cents for the first year. I'll put a link down below in the description to the promotions page so you can check those out. As you can see here, they have a list of a whole bunch of different domains available for just 99 cents for the first year. One of the things I would pay attention to if you scroll down a little bit further though, is you know pay attention to what the renewals will cost. So a dot college domain is gonna cost you $55 a year, but that link is only gonna cost you another $11 per year. All right, now that you have your domain picked out, the next two things that I would add to your to-do list would be one, getting a professional business email set up, we can help you do that with our G Suite tutorial that I'll link to up above right here. And then the next thing is obviously building your website. We always build all of our websites with Squarespace and we have a tutorial for that that I'll link to right here. Until next time, bye bye.